Okay, we're back playing every single game in my Steam library. The first game today is called AI War Fleet Command. Oh, it's loud. Oh, it's so loud. Why are these games at 50 million decibels? Whoa. Okay. The art's not bad. I'm impressed by the artwork so far. This is the kind of game where you have to actually pay attention to the tutorial, but I got over 500 games to play, man. I don't got time for the tutorial. I'm just going to click for like five minutes, and if I can't get the ships to move, we'll move on. If I can get them to move, though, then we're in business. Okay, we're in business. The little guy's moving. Click to send selected ships through. Okay. I sent that guy to Ipquil. Oh my god, did I kill him? Did he just go into the black hole and die? Where'd he go? He's gone. Oh no. Okay, I can't figure this game out within two minutes. So it might be good. I'm not going to say it's bad because I have no idea. But I'm an impatient modern gamer. So to me, it's terrible. Everybody loves Alan Wake. But let's see what all the fuss is about because I've never played it. Wow, they invoked Stephen King in the beginning line. Wow, okay. That, that's a high bar. Oh, he's like Stephen King. Oh, okay. So I'm playing as Stephen King in a Stephen King town. Okay, I get it. I get it. Oh no, a coastal road. Dude, coastal towns are always the most haunted towns. I could hardly stand my feet. <laughs> I like how he could hardly stand on his feet. He like almost tripped over just standing still. <laughs> what was that movie called? In the Mouth of Madness? Is that what this is? Is this In the Mouth of Madness, the game? Because that was a good movie. If that's that, but this is the video game version, this is going to be a good one. How do I press space to jump? Oh no. <laughs> press shift to dodge. Okay, come on. Ready, ready? Dark Souls. Ooh, Dark Souls. Check it out. You met Sigurd. Yeah. <laughs> he does look like Sigurd. He's like an exact copy of Sigurd. Sigurd, no. Oh no, Sigurd is dead. I don't like this game anymore. Turn the strobe light off, dude. Turn it off. Ah, it's too bright. I'm going to go get killed by the axe guy. I'm not playing a whole game where I look at strobe lights. I'll pick up the revolver. Yeah, here we go. See, this is this is when the game gets good right here. All right, buddy. Die. Die. How much health? You're just a regular guy. How much health do you have? Oh, it was just a dream the whole time. Thank God. I'm sure that I won't be fighting any more of those enemies. Do I really have to wait for this boat to get all the way to the shore? Oh, I'm so immersed. Yay. Whoa, look at that. The 68th. Oh, 68th annual. Come on. So close to having the 69th annual Deer Fest. If we don't get more gun action in the next five minutes, we're going to the next game. Why is she wearing that? I would leave. I would leave this cabin if this lady was in charge. Yeah, I'm, I'm out of here. Look at that. She's in charge of this place. I do not trust her one bit. And she has a flickering light. She lives in a hallway with a flickering light. Oh my god. It's the diver. Oh, I got jump scared. Ah... Why would you leave her in the cabin with the spooky lady? The spooky lady was right there. You're gonna just leave your wife with her? This is the Alan Wake is the worst boyfriend slash husband. Dude, this guy sucks. You have found manuscript pages. Oh no! It introduced a collectible. Okay, we're out of here. Not playing this. All right, guys. The next game is also Alan Wake. So <laughs> I hope you guys liked Alan Wake because he's back. Oh, they have the G-Man. There's a G-Man in this game now. Okay, I should I should have played the first one. I don't know what's happening. Oh, this guy's super fat. I like this. Check him out, it's a fat biker with a pickaxe. Oh, he takes more bullets to kill because he's fat. <laughs> Sometimes running is the best option. No, dude, there's an explosive barrel right here. Come on, guys. Come on down. Come on down. Haha, oh, it did nothing. That didn't do anything. Oh! Oh, I hope a bunch of enemies don't pop up when I go to get the page. Oh, no! What the? This is not fair. This is not fair. What? I was ready for that ambush and it still got me. Open up. Open up. It won't open. Can I shoot it? Nope. That's the American solution. <laughs> Can I shoot it? Oh, shoot it. It didn't work. Oh, no. Now what do I do? No problem. Oh, she flipped the wrench around. That's how you know she's good with cars. Is that a satellite? Oh, it got hit by an asteroid. What the heck? What is this? This is great. Oh, no. Look out. <laughs> I made a satellite crash into the tower. Is this Donnie Darko? Yay. I did it. I rewrote reality. I truly am the champion of light. Alpha protocol. Oh, it's... Oh, why? Stop making your game so loud. Soldier, field agent, tech specialist, or freelancer. Dude, look at the freelancer. Dude, I'm being the freelancer. Look at that guy. Let's see. I'm going to put all my points in pistols because I'm a freelancer. Obsidian. Oh, Obsidian made this. What? Alpha protocol has been pulled from Steam after Sega's rights expired. Uh-oh. Dude. This is another uh, another exclusive look, just like After Fallen Sanity. Also, that's the Mass Effect font. That is a Mass Effect 2 font, 
And this is the Mass Effect 2 opening. Okay, this is Cerberus. I'm in Cerberus right now. It's the same game. Oh, a gun. Oh, it's Tranquilizer. What? No. Give me the real gun. Oh, nice try, idiot. Die. Oh, what the? Oh, it's Mass Effect 1 aiming. Oh, no. Find the two passwords in the data stream. Oh, I hate this. No, I don't want to do this. Why did he build a big monitor out of TVs that had that bad resolution? Sarcastic, yes. Sarcastic. Pick sarcastic. Fallout 4. No, yeah. It's a morphine mite. Yeah. Restricted area. Authorized personnel only. Oh, no. When it's got that font, you know it's from the military. Oh, here we go. All right. This is this is where the game gets good. Five o'clock shadow. Groomed. Circle beard. Goatee. Goatee 2. Whoa. Whoa. Look at that. Oh, yes. Swamp hat. Look at this. Look at this. My eye is from Duck Dynasty confirmed. You guys must have spent a fortune on the TVs in this place. I was thinking You're about that. Done. I'm getting lots of interference. Switch off video conference. Yes. Turn them off. Turn them off. Figure things out from Turn them off. Sir. Shut what? the council down. <laughs> yes. Oh, I like this. Aggressive. Draw a gun. Oh, draw a gun. Yeah. As we said nothing about an American. Well, let me show you my credentials. Oh, yes. That was great. What a one-liner. always got to go in with guns. I love this game. Terrorist show game is through. Soon you have to answer to America. See, this right here is a stealth section. There's a lot of random crates. You're supposed to sneak through here. <laughs> but I'm not gonna. I don't play by the rules. I'm a loose cannon. Tell me where the Hellbeck missiles are, or I add you to the body count. Oh, yeah. My guy's Jesus. hardcore. What you do now, huh? Kill me? Yes. No. <laughs> uh, this game is great. Okay. Sorry. Alpha Protocol is a fantastic game. Friends. I highly recommend playing Let's this finish. one. Okay, the next game is called Always, Sometimes, Monsters, and it looks like it was made in RPG Maker, so I think we're in for a dramatic drop in quality here. Oh no, look out! It's the hooded figure. Oh my god. Dude! Dude, you can't be saying that! What the hell is this? You might say I've been expecting you. Okay, I don't care. Oh, he's got a gun! He's got a gun! Oh, I got a gun too! Wait, where did I click? Oh, I clicked shoot him. Okay, good. That's what I was hoping for. Every story ends. Was this how it was supposed to happen? Wait. Oh, I bet you I killed my character. I bet that was my guy, and it was gonna go to a flashback and be like, it all started back then, but... <laughs> okay. That was the Always Sometimes Monster Speed Run. I <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed that one. That was really... That was a great game. Okay, this next game is called Benoit Sokal Presents Amerizone The Explorer's Legacy. I have no clue. I'm gonna guess point and click adventure. Oh my god, what the? It made my screen go into 240p and it's like 50, oh god. All right, I gotta go ahead and give this one the old Alt F4 treatment because this is not working. I can't kill it. I can't kill the process, guys. What kind of freaking game? Oh, hang on. It died. It went away. Haha. -ha. okay, well. My review for Benoit Sokal Presents Amerizone The Explorer's Legacy is that it's literally malware that turns your computer off almost. Okay, that was terrible. No, thank you. I'm not playing. Oh, no. It launched itself again. What? No. Let's see. It has it has mixed reviews. Really? Mixed review. 101 reviews. Wait. Why does it have 101 reviews? Only two words are necessary. Ben Benoit Sokal. There. Go buy it. Benoit Sokal does not create games like we know them. This is better than the actual game. He creates worlds and invites us to explore. Even though the backgrounds are static, there is life all around. And you can see SoCal's creations come into view and dart out of you, or actually confront you. Huh, I'm getting ahead of myself. Oh my god, this guy wrote a master's thesis. Watching the trailer instead of playing the game is probably a better option for this one, honestly. You probably need an emulator of Windows XP to play it properly? Yeah, probably, honestly. I should try running it in compatibility mode. You know, if I cared. Freaking Benoit SoCal, who do you think you are? Benoit SoCal probably wrote this review. This review was not written by Point and Clickster. This review was written by Benoit SoCal, and he got it for free. All right, the next game is Antichamber. I know this is a good game. Some paths are clearer than others, okay. All red or blue. Gotta go red, you gotta go red. Come on. Red's the color of action. Oh God, oh no. Now I remember what this game is. I remember, it's like a mind-bending puzzle type thing. Oh, no. We're going blue. And that didn't work either. The choice doesn't matter if the outcome's the same. Yeah, thanks. Go backward. Oh, thanks, chat. <laughs> dude, I'm cheating. I have Twitch chat on. That shouldn't be allowed for puzzle games. The end? Dude, I beat the game. Okay, well, I saw a sign that said the end, so I'm gonna go ahead and say I got to the end. Okay, the next game is Arma 2. 
You guys have probably all seen Soviet Wombles videos of hilarious Arma moments. Well, let me tell you, actually playing Arma is not quite as fun. It's a very tactical game. Only real gamers can play Arma <laughs> and do whatever. Hang on, was that a, what was that? Whoop. <laughs> let me just uh, step over this barrier here. Whoopsie daisy, whoa. This is the real World War Three simulator. Like in Arma, you run to the objective for like an hour, you get there and you die from something you can't see. I do like this game, surprisingly enough, even though it looks like it sucks. I do find it fun. Oh boy, we're taking big fire, but from where, but from where? Oh God, oh APC, oh no, oh I'm pinned. Oh, this is bad. Oh, I'm dead. Arma 3 is good. All right, here it is, CQC Kill House. I have tried this map at least 100 times. I've never successfully beaten this map. We're gonna try it right now. All right, so the gimmick here is there's bad guys, that shoot you instantly when they see you, which is kind of an issue. I'm afraid. Oh, I'm afraid to... Oh, there's a guy. Crap. Die. Oh, crap. Whew. Oh, I got him. That was so close. I die in like one hit, by the way, if you couldn't tell from my extreme caution. Crap. Oh, no. Ha. <laughs> I'm never going to beat this. Oh, dude. I can make him an ODST? I forgot I had that mod. All right, cool. We're being an ODST. Alrighty, there we go. We have a Halo Assault Rifle with an ODST hat. Now we can win. Oh, Okay, I didn't even see that guy. Arma 3. Oh, yeah, dude. This gun rocks. Arma 3. Oh, this thing destroys, dude. Is there going to be a guy here? There is. Ah, oh, crap. No. Okay. Dude, the Halo shotgun is busted. Oh, never mind. Okay, well. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm never going to beat that mission. All right, here we go. Stylish vest and audio surf. A world premiere. I guarantee no one's ever done this before. Lock pop your lie. The founders and the songbird. Out to hear from this false check burp. Do the horror look sick. Oh, dude, we have Sonic R. We gotta play Sonic R. It makes me feel so free, so alive. It makes me wanna survive. There we go. Okay, that was fun. Audio Surf, good game. I like Audio Surf. Alrighty, this next game is called Ballistic. The story, names, and characters are all fictitious. Say fictional, don't say fictitious. Dude, I got an achievement for skipping the intro cutscene. That's great. I love this game. Oh, it's so loud. Why? Stop making your games. 10 million. Oh, oh. Bam. Oh, yeah. Bam. John Wick. I'm John Stick. Ooh, okay. Oh, okay. Ah. Okay, I tried. I tried to play that Stickman game. I like stick figure action games. I'm sure that game is very good, but the sound, dude. There was no option to turn the sound down. I couldn't even think because it was so loud. All right, looks like the last game for today is going to be a hey, Battle Block Theater. This game was made by the boys of Newgrounds. Oh, okay. Oh, that makes sense. This, this is what happens when you... Hey, that stick game we just played is a classic Newgrounds game. And this is what happens when you give a Newgrounds game of actual budget. Ooh. 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 Oh, get Dodge Cat. Okay. All right, Battle Block Theater review. I like this one. This is a good game. Uh, the best game from that stream was probably Alpha Protocol, solely for the amazing dialogue. So uh, see you next time.